The first thing would be a child in significant respiratory distress, and that would be a child who has noisy breathing, recession, a child whose breathing has become particularly fast or laboured, and in extreme cases, a child who is cyanotic or blue. The other thing we'd be concerned about is in children who have a saturation monitor, if their saturations are dropping and they're becoming hypoxic. The first way to check that a tracheostomy is in place and patent is to simply try and pass a suction catheter. If you're unable to pass a suction catheter, we definitely regard that as a red flag. Uh, and then under those circumstances, you'd want to be doing an emergency tube change. If you notice any of these red flags, it's really important that you're taking action immediately. Uh, and if you've got a child who's in significant respiratory distress, you would need to move to the emergency algorithm.